Hello, my beautiful and courageous friends. It's Natalie Kelly here. And today I'm here with Dr. Lori Chaikin, who's a rehab optometrist here in Alameda, California. When the waves came and when the storm raged, found myself falling into the ground. When the wind blew, that's when it fell through. And I don't know how to turn it around. I know there's more to me than the record you see. There's more to be. I'm still on the journey. I'm still on the journey. So what other kind of tools have you found to be really helpful with people, for people? Well, there's 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 many different tools. There's the uh, the vest. There's the color therapy. Um, there's a different couple of different ways that I use colors. One is first to understand that the visual system has many non-visual light receptors, and those those non-visual light receptors go directly to the hypothalamus pineal gland pituitary gland, and they help to. Uh, provide <clears throat> input into balancing the hormonal system. And we can use light therapy going directly into the eyes to help to um, help to contribute to rebalancing the system. And sometimes we can help with light sensitivity, extreme light sensitivity um, by doing that. Other times we can't, but that can be helpful with that um, at times. Um, we can use it for um, helping with sleep, dysfunctions and resetting circadian rhythms um, can also help with that. Um, sometimes we use, uh, I use lights, light therapy by tinting the lenses a particular color. And so I'll have someone like what you did go through and try different filters and see which one um, has a certain effect. And, and you found that there was a particular color that helped you feel more relaxed and helped yeah. you enhance vision in a certain way. I felt like my whole body could suddenly relax. It was like this, oh, I've been starving for that color. Exactly, and that's, yeah. that's the response that we're looking for. Not everyone has that response, but a number of people do. And it's, it always amazes me that the responses that people um, share, with they'll, they'll say that, they'll say that, uh, they'll say that, that you know, diff different colors help their whole body to relax. Um, one person said that all the colors made the world look drab except for one color that all of a sudden everything turned on and that's that's what we're looking looking for and some people there's no color and they don't have a response to any particular color but it's great when we do and it's really cool and what yeah, it does it is really cool it's very helpful we also use uh different um therapies from a vision therapy point of view so we'll do um different exercises and activities to help the system to reorganize. Like we'll use the Brock string or vectograms or um, different techniques to um, help reorganize vision. So and some can, of those exercises are on your website, aren't they? Some of them are. Mm -hmm. And you uh, can find that there. They can we'll... find it there, but I don't recommend just trying them. They really need to go to yes. a specialist to get uh, diagnosed because yeah. you really you can't, you can't diagnose yourself. You need to go to someone that specializes in this area. Um, and I, I would recommend you can go to the um, covd.org website as one way to find a practitioner. You can also go to NORA. Um, NORA is the Neuro Optometric Rehab Association. Mm -hmm. um, they have a website where you can find uh, doctors Great. that are specializing in this area or therapists that are specializing in this area. When the wind blew, that's when it fell through. And I don't know how to turn it around. I know there's more to me than the record you see. There's more to be.